What's going on guys? Out at Pueblo Motorsports Park getting ready to set up for the free car event this weekend. I'm nervous, I'm excited, it's gonna be crazy. The uh, turnout so far looks like it's gonna be wild, but I'm here actually getting ready to unload some equipment to help us out with the event. H&E Equipment Services is uh, letting us use this forklift for the day and uh, to help build my first burnout pit. So that's what this video is gonna be about. It's building a burnout pit. So we got that and then they're bringing this down. Uh, to display in their booth and uh, hang out with everybody for the day. So it's pretty cool all the sponsors that have jumped on board for this thing. So we're gonna get this unloaded, then we gotta go get the concrete blocks, then we gotta mock up the burnout pit to make sure we're ready for Saturday. This is all the work it takes to build a burnout pit. My buddy AJ with 5150 Trucking donated his time bringing a flatbed out to help me load. There's actually two trucks coming to get like 30 blocks, uh, maybe 26-ish blocks of these big concrete mafia blocks. These weigh about 3,000 pounds a piece. And the Fremont Ready Mix here is a concrete plant. And these are like, they, how these come about is from runoff of concrete. So, you know, a buddy, Justin Willis, reached out to me and said, hey, I might be able to help you figure out where to get some of those concrete blocks for the burnout pit, because I made a post about it on Facebook. AJ reached out and said, hey, you need some help with anything, let me know. I knew he did trucking. So between the two of them, they are helping donate time and product to letting us use them for to build a safe burnout pit for this event. So huge shout out to both of these companies because it's so cool, the community that's came around us to make all this happen. Sorry I'm losing my voice. It's been a crazy week already, but uh, let's get to loading some blocks. Oh, man. How about, how about? Thanks, dude. Appreciate your help no with problem. this. The other truck's about 20 minutes. Perfect. He's right cool. there. And truck number two. Thanks for coming out, man. Helping out. Appreciate it. another task but I hope that everybody comes out and enjoys this and all this extra work and effort we put into making this thing happen I think you guys are gonna appreciate it 96, 96 with 3 billion miles on it <laughs> yeah I mean you just had this one rebuilt uh, not too long ago yeah and so did he um, mine longer than his but uh, we we're talking about how many miles all the trucks have and it's like He's like, how much on the motor or the, the cab? You know, he's like three million and then just got rebuilt not long ago. And this has like, what'd you say, one point? This is 1.8 million. 1.8 on the chassis. So pretty crazy how long these things, like unless you're in the semi world, you know, type of, this is, it's pretty sick. Well, the whole key is, is maintenance. You take yeah. care of it, it takes care of you. <laughs> right. Very <Pretty> heavy. <laughs> yeah, I know. Tell how heavy it is. Yeah. A little, little different than normal. Oh yeah. <laughs> They're saying these are like 3,000 pounds a piece, about ish. Yeah, we got 13 on me and we got 14 on him. Yep. yep. <laughs> so sick. Got a little bit of rain, cleared off the pad, they're sweeping it for us. So much fun. They actually have another event to run Friday night. So we have to like set it up, break it down, and then kind of reset it up Saturday morning. So tons of work, but this is kind of what I do is I want to make sure it's right. So I have a plan so then Saturday we're not screwed. So I will build this pit twice just to make sure we got something good to work with. First block going into place. Get these things unloaded real quick. Shout out to all these guys. Alex out here, Sean. Everybody's helping us out. So what do you say, man? <laughs> he said, go ahead and move it. So, uh, let's see. He said, push pull. Little 
aggressive. A little aggressive on the clutch key. All right, let's try that again. Gotta be real easy on the clutch. There we go. First time of a lot of things today. Whew, the brakes are touchy on this unit. I'm learning, man, I'm learning, jeez. It's only a $40,000 track. <laughs> right, I'm kinda, kinda botched the old start up there with the, the air brake, but it's so touchy. Yeah. Like the brakes even like stopping are oh, yeah. crazy good. Like, yeah, Yeah. it's a whole different ordeal now, even now driving hear, like that. When you hear like a semi is like, has them locked up, it's no joke, they lock Yeah, yeah, up. yeah, cause the brakes work crazy well which unloaded no but i could get it with all the weight behind it you'd need it but oh, yeah. like that's pretty cool thanks for the experience man. no problem so now we're grabbing all the blocks that the track had so it's about 60 total blocks to make this thing happen so pretty crazy a lot to, a lot of concrete blocks to build a pit but so we're actually picking these up just popping them on the trailer Taking them back over so we're not carrying each one with the fork all the way over there. We're getting there, boys. We're getting there. This is freaking awesome. These things are heavier than hell. It's a lot of work. Got some awesome guys that stopped by to help us and everything. So, this community coming together to help make this thing happen. So, we could take some of those, go over there now, and then come back and finish this out when we're done. So, we might head over there, try and taper it in. Kind of limited on blocks. I mean, I got quite a few, but once you start placing them, I mean, you only got what you got. So uh, it's still gonna end up being pretty good size. It's like a hundred foot, about 110 long by almost 80 wide. So pretty big pit, really. Um, so I think it should work out. You didn't think we weren't gonna burn, build a burnout pit and not do a burnout. So uh, we brought Bernie out to try to do a test burnout. I built it, might as well test it. coming together so crazy that we're putting this thing together but it's so fun at the same time so a lot of work today a little payoff today big payoff saturday new driver today i am going to send it in the burnout pit now now that we have it built test it out test it out Mark of, the, mark of the path, dude. Killed it. Killed it. Killed it. Thanks, man. All right. April did a little tip in. It worked. Bernie was at his first gear, just simple for her to practice. No big deal. And uh, the pit worked. It is a little bit tighter, but it you can still keep spinning and working your way around it. So this is going to be perfect for the vent. It'll do what we need it to do. And I'm uh, pretty freaking stoked to do this. So good job out of Phil. I approve of this pad. <laughs> it it is officially ready for burnout. Right? Other than that, now we got to break it all down. So, we will see you guys Saturday morning. Gates at 11. Make sure you're here. You're not going to want to miss the free car event. See you guys.